Michigan's iconic winter landscapes, including the ice that covers the Great Lakes, are vanishing right before our eyes. And it's not just a fluke. Scientists say this is quickly becoming our new normal. As of this week, only about 20% of the Great Lakes are covered in ice, according to new reports from Bridge, Michigan. A decade ago, that number was closer to 60%. And just last year, ice coverage dipped to a record low of 2.7% in early February. Climate scientists say it's all tied to climate change, driven by human activity like burning fossil fuels. Warmer air means warmer water, and that keeps the lakes from freezing like they should. And that lack of ice, it has big implications for Michigan. First, it makes for more intense lake effect snow. Warmer air means more moisture in the air, which can turn into heavier snow for cities like Grand Rapids and Marquette. But the impact doesn't stop there. Less ice means more shoreline erosion, stressed fish populations, and a hit to Michigan's winter economy. Just last year, Black Lake had to cancel its sturgeon fishing season for the first time since 1947. Marquette's UP200 sled dog race canceled in 2023 because of heavy rain and scrapped again last year due to the weather. Winter is part of Michigan's cultural identity, but it's also a big driver for business, with winter recreation contributing billions of dollars to Michigan's economy every year. And it's all changing right before our eyes. So what can we do? Climate scientists say the best way to protect our winters is to cut greenhouse gas emissions and invest in clean energy solutions, which under the Trump administration now seems to be on shakier ground than ever before. Let me know in the comments, what are your favorite winter traditions here in Michigan, and how would you feel if they disappeared?